Welcome to Dimu's Tutorials. Let us learn interview questions on gauges. Question, what is the importance of gauges in manufacturing? Answer, gauge is a part of inspection system. During production, it is not feasible to inspect each and every component with measuring instrument, because it will consume lot of time. Measurement with instrument may vary person to person and other conditions like calibration of instruments. There is very less scope for difference of opinion between manufacturer and customer, when parts inspected with gauges. Question, list the types of gauges utilized in manufacturing. Answer, plug gauge, snap gauge, thread ring gauge, thread plug gauge, setting master gauge, pin gauge, slip gauge, radius gauges, and filler gauges. Question, what is the difference between plug and snap gauges? Answer, plug gauges are used for inspecting internal diameters. And snap gauges are used to inspect external diameters. Question, plug gauge can inspect diameters, then why pin gauges are needed? Answer, plug gauges have go and no go diameters at two extreme edge, and can decide quickly. They are customized for mass production. For diameters in prototypes, tools, and dies, pin gauges are useful. They come in sets of diameter in ascending order with difference of 1 mm. They are useful when production quantity is very much less. Two separate pin gauges are used to judge extreme sizes of hole. Question, explain the method of inspecting radius using gauges. Answer, not the round hole, or shaft, but when part has fillets or arcs. Radius gauges are useful. Inspection with radius gauge is subject to experience and visual skills of inspector. In this measurement, radius profile of test piece is visualized against gauge. Question, explain application of slip gauge with an example. Answer, this is an example of strip, where slip gauge is used for inspection of distance A. This will need two slip gauges, one with height of upper and second with lower spec of distance A. During inspection, if curved projection touches upper limit slip gauge, and do not touch lower limit slip gauge, the part will be okay. This will depend on visual skills of inspector. Question. Tell some situations where only filler gauges are useful. Answer, filler gauges are extremely useful in identifying small gaps between two components. Question, what are the parameters of threads measured in thread gauges? Answer, thread gauges can inspect internal as well as external thread. After half or one thread, if gauge is unable to pass through the threads to be measured, it will be assumed not to be within specifications. Cause of not passing the thread gauge can be, error in external diameter or drill diameter. Pitch of thread not maintained as per specifications. Thread profile not as per required specs. Thread forming tap or die comes in sets of three. It is called first tap or die, second tap or die and third tap or die. Non-utilization of third tap or die, may affects thread geometry. Thanks for watching. Log on to dies.biz for more engineering tutorials.